Hello friends, my name is Larissa from the Eczema Diaries, and today I will be sharing with you my nighttime skincare routine for my eczema using Eczema Honey products. I've struggled with eczema for as long as I can remember, but it really became the most severe in my early 20s. It was at that point that I decided to ditch the steroids in search of a more natural remedy for my condition. Now, being an adult with eczema has its challenges. <laughs> Sweeping the cosmetic aisles, trying to find products that won't irritate your skin can be a struggle, and finding a natural product that actually works can be just as challenging. It can also be disheartening to watch other videos with nighttime skincare routines, knowing that many of the items used are likely too harsh for your sensitive skin. So that's why I decided to make this video. For those of us with highly sensitive skin, eczema, psoriasis, rosacea, or even just really reactive skin, the line from Eczema Honey gets the job done without causing irritation. And better yet, in my experience, it actually helped my dryness, redness, and itchiness. Eczema Honey uses safe, non-toxic, and all-natural ingredients, many of which are organically derived, which I love. They also put an emphasis on high-quality and food-grade ingredients, known for revitalizing and skin-loving properties. Each cosmetic-grade ingredient serves a specific therapeutic purpose, so there aren't any fillers. Plus, they are made in the U.S. and never tested on animals. You can explore their entire collection at eczemahoneyco.com and find select products at your local CVS pharmacy. This routine will remove the day and lock in the hydration our skin so desperately craves. So, let's get started. I like to create a calm atmosphere by turning down the lights, lighting a few candles, and misting some lavender essential oil for aromatherapy. Starting with freshly washed hands and a cleansed face, I begin with the brown sugar face and body scrub. It's important your skin is cleansed before exfoliating, or you can end up rubbing the grime further into your pores. Using a spatula, I take a small scoop from the pot. This helps keep the scrub fresh and free of bacteria. I then massage it onto my face in circular motions using the tips of my fingers. Brown sugar is a natural humectant, which prevents moisture loss, while honey and beeswax are ultra hydrating, so it's basically a match made in heaven. The brown sugar and honey begin to melt and slough away dry skin. I love the feeling as it dissolves. You can really feel the sugar crystals gently removing these pesky surface flakes. Meanwhile, the vitamin E, olive, and grapeseed oils leave the skin feeling slick and silky smooth. I'm someone who has a sensitivity to salt scrubs, and this is much gentler. I rinse with lukewarm water on a washcloth. Make sure it isn't too hot as this can irritate the skin and cause itching. Unlike with other scrubs, my skin is left feeling both exfoliated and hydrated. Next, I use the Itch Cooling Face and Body Rounds. Sometimes after cleansing and exfoliating, my skin is left feeling tight and itchy, particularly if I'm in the middle of a flare. These rounds completely prevent that from happening. Formulated with aloe vera, vitamin E, jojoba oil, oat extract, and witch hazel, these rounds act as a soothing toner. Gently swipe the wipe across the face, being sure not to tug on the delicate area around the eyes. They are so large I can usually use them down my neck and on the insides of my elbows where it gets particularly itchy. You can use both sides to get more out of it. They can be used on your legs and body too, and are gentle enough for daily use. Then I move on to moisturizing with the Skin Soothing Cream. It is made of pure honey, beeswax, sunflower, and almond oils, giving it a nourishing, smooth texture that instantly makes the skin feel healthy and hydrated. They also have a nut-free version for those with a sensitivity or allergy to nuts. And even though it has honey in it, it doesn't feel sticky or tacky at all. I use just a small dab and carefully apply it to my face, using a slightly heavier hand on patches that need extra love. The honey gives it a calming aroma that helps with relaxation before bedtime. For a real pro tip, you can store this in the refrigerator for an extra cooling effect when your skin is angry and flaring. I finish off my face with the Nourishing Lip Balm, the power-packed combination of collodial oatmeal, mango butter, beeswax, vitamin E, and olive oil provide a protective shield that lasts. It also has a hint of mint and lime for an extra fresh feeling. You can apply it like a normal lip balm, and if you struggle with lip eczema, you can dab a little extra around your mouth with your pinky. Finally, I go in with the Soothing Scalp Oil. The blend of tea tree oil, lavender oil, aloe vera, vitamin E, olive, and jojoba oil 
Not only makes it smell great, but it feels soothing and cooling on an itchy scalp. It's easier to have your hair down for this step. I apply about three drops to my fingers and gently knead it into my scalp, focusing on my hairline where it tends to be the driest. Take a few extra minutes to massage your scalp. This can be very therapeutic and relieve any built up tension in your head and neck. This is also great for the lymphatic system and an extra little dose of self-love. And that's it. You can head off to dreamland and let the restorative and nourishing properties of eczema honey work its magic. Sweet dreams.